Hello friends, it's Mario Romero with the Melcher Agency and thank you for joining me today. As you know, the real estate market has continued to soar in the early weeks of 2021. The prices are still climbing, but how much higher can they go? Your window of opportunity in this market could be shrinking. So here's what you need to know about what's going on in our market right now. Part of the reason is the mortgage rates are projected to increase and what does that mean for you? We're currently experiencing historically low mortgage rates. Over the last 50 years, the average on a Freddie Mac 30 year fixed rate mortgage has been 7.76%. Today that rate is 2.81%. So of course, flocks of homeowner, home buyers have been taking advantage of these remarkably low rates over the last 12 months. However, there's no guarantee rates will remain this low much longer. Many things impact mortgage rates, the economy, inflation, and Fed policy, just to name a few. What makes forecasting rates difficult, however, there is not one metric that has held up over the last 50 years. Many things impact mortgage rates. The economy, inflation, and Fed policy, just to name a few. And that makes forecasting rates difficult. However, there is one metric that has held up over the last 50 years. The relationship between mortgage rates and the 10-year Treasury rate. Over the last five decades, there's been an average of 1.7 point spread between these two rates. It's this long-term relationship that has some forecasters projecting an increase in mortgage rates as we move throughout the year. And this is based on the recent surge in the 10-year Treasury rate. The spread between the two is now 1.53, indicating mortgage rates could rise. Actually, a bump up in rate has already begun. How high might they go in 2021, you ask? No one knows for sure. The chief economist for Freddie Mac recently suggested, while there are multiple temporary factors driving up rates, the underlying economic fundamentals point to rates remaining in the low 3% range for the year. Now, what does this mean for you? Whether you're a first-time buyer or you've purchased a home before, even an increase of half a point in mortgage rate, 2.81 to 3.31 makes a big difference. On a $30,000 mortgage, that difference, including principal and interest, is $82 a month. That's $984 a year, or a total of $29,520 over the life of the home loan. Bottom line, based on the 50-year symbiotic relationship between industry rates and mortgage rates, it appears mortgage rates could be headed up this year. It may make sense to buy now rather than wait. If you have any questions about potentially selling your home or trading up to a new property, feel free to give me a call anytime. I can help you make the right decision for whatever you decide to do. It's been a challenging year for all of us, so be safe stay healthy, and reach out to your loved ones. We appreciate you for your friendship, referrals, and for trusting us with all your real estate needs. Without your support, we wouldn't be where we are today. We've met some incredible people along the way, and we've had the honor of helping many of you in accomplishing your real estate dreams. Take care and make it a great day.